Well, this is the Hillside Drafting Studio. Uh, this was designed by Frank Lloyd Wright in 1932 uh, for students, apprentices of his, in the Taliesin Fellowship. He knew that he was going to be getting a lot of people working with him, and he knew that his drafting studio at his house uh, was not going to have enough room. And so he designed this space, which is 5,000 square feet. And then apprentices in the Taliesin Fellowship helped to build it over the next couple of years. Now again, this is during the Great Depression, starting in 1932, and Wright did not have a lot of money at that time. And so they did things kind of on the fly, a little, a uh, little scrappy. Uh, they used, uh, they, they forested uh, trees themselves, and uh, put them right into the building without waiting for them to, to dry, to weather over time. Uh, so when people were working on the, the wood trusses in the room, uh, there, were, there was actually pine sap coming off on their hands. Uh, they also um, had to make all of the, the plaster walls. They made them out of local materials because that's all that they could afford. And uh, they finally got some glass uh, that was uh, donated to them. The glass is important at Hillside uh, in the drafting studio for the way that it's oriented. The way the room is oriented is it's oriented towards the north. And you have uh, just a little bit of light coming in through glass on the east, the north, and the west. And so that brings light in in the morning. And then through most of the day, you get a nice northern light that's very even. And then uh, in the late afternoon, you have western light coming in, uh, brightening up the space a little bit more. Uh, the the uh, studio is still being used today by students in the Frank Lloyd Wright School of Architecture. Uh, that is the descent, or the descendant of the Taliesin Fellowship. Uh, people who worked under Frank Lloyd Wright eventually became uh, some of the teachers in the School of Architecture. And uh, then these students come out uh, and they live here for five months of every year, working in the drafting studio, working in these buildings, living in these buildings, and they're studying architecture. And uh, then they will leave once winter comes and they go down to Frank Lloyd Wright's winter home, Taliesin West which is outside of Scottsdale, Arizona. So it's the same group of people that moves back and forth. And the great thing about the Hillside Drafting Studio is that uh, really you can see the structure, the way that it's being held up. It's a wonderful experiment for engineering and architecture. And it's a, it's a great thing for students in architecture to live in an experiment and to work in an experiment and learn from that um, year over year.